Hello everyone, my name is Preston Dennett, and I'm pleased to announce that my latest book, Inside UFOs, has just been released. It presents 10 all new cases of people who've had extensive contact with UFOs. I'm going to try and get through all 10 cases in less than three minutes. The first chapter is about a man named Kevin, a Navy corpsman, who was invited aboard a UFO where he met 15 foot tall praying mantises who took him on a time travel trip. It's an extraordinary case. Chapter two is about a gentleman I call Taylor. He's now a doctor. When he was a little boy, his mom sent him out to mail a letter and he instead had contact with friendly Nordic aliens. And this began a lifelong contact with gray type ETs. A really interesting case. Chapter three is about a gentleman who is now a college professor. As a young boy, he was delivering papers when this UFO came right down on top of him. He experienced missing time and some extraordinary after effects as a result of his encounter. I think it's a very important case. Chapter four is about a lady named Jeannie, and she found out that she was having contact with a nine foot tall grasshopper type ET as well as gray type ETs. This is an extraordinary case. One of my favorite chapters is chapter five. It's about a gentleman, a professor and writer who was driving along and had a UFO land right in front of him and outstepped this handsome looking Nordic alien. It's a very interesting benevolent encounter with ETs. Chapter six, the alien outside the window involves an office worker, a new mother who had just had a baby boy and woke up to see a gray type ET looking through her window straight at her newborn son. Uh, it was a terrifying encounter for her. Chapter seven is about a gentleman named Harry who's had some extraordinary UFO sightings his entire life. One of his very close up encounters was with his wife. They were driving along the road when they came upon a UFO hovering right alongside the road. And there were two grays looking outside a large picture window right at them. Harry has had some of the most extraordinary UFO sightings of anyone I've ever interviewed. Another one of my favorite chapters is chapter eight about a gentleman named Jim who worked in the Navy as an electronics specialist. He had an extraordinary sighting with several shipmates. Turned out to be much more than a sighting. He was contacted by ETs who taught him about alternative energy sources. It's one of my favorite cases in the book. Chapter nine is about an amazing lady, a housewife and mother from Nebraska who became very sick and suddenly had an encounter in which she was taken into what appears to be an underground base where she was healed of her illness by a nine foot tall ET with orange spiky hair. It's a totally unique case. The 10th and final chapter is about a man, a medical worker named Kenneth. He's had extraordinary encounters, missing time, and face-to-face -face encounters with gray-type ETs. They had a fully conscious encounter in which the ETs explained exactly why they contacted him. And he also experienced some very interesting after effects. So that's it. That's my book, Inside UFOs. I don't think I did it in quite three minutes, but I tried. And now you have a good idea of what's inside, inside UFOs. Thanks for watching.